Hello, today's video uh, is sponsored by the New National Assistance Program.com. So if you just type in the New National Assistance Program.com, then you can print out a card like one of these. This is a card you give to the pharmacist, they give you a discount. I went to the pharmacist, I gave them my card, I quit smoking. That medicine is so expensive, it's like four hundred something dollars down where I live at in Louisiana. But uh, after I gave them that card there, uh, it dropped down to $179. So uh, good luck with that. And uh, okay, so we're gonna take this and we're gonna make us a couple little marks all the way around it here, so we can find the center of this uh, lid right here, because you know that these things are gonna fit down inside there. So that's my center and my hole. Uh, now I got to go dig some tools. Now one other thing I'm doing here. This is uh, I don't know if this would be the best way to do this or not, but this is the way I'm doing it. Uh, the limited amount of tools that I do have. Uh, so anyway, I'm taking a screwdriver, one of these suckers, and I'm going along that little line at an angle. I'm just knocking the crap out of it. Uh, when I get it out, you'll see what's up. But you can tell the beginning of that didn't work out so well. Uh, with some of the other things. I tried this, that didn't work. I tried this, that didn't work. I tried this, that didn't work. Uh, I tried a few other little gadgets I had laying around and that didn't work either. Uh, so, but uh, this seems to be working the best. It has a flatter tip to it. Now you so, see, as you can see, that didn't take long at all. Uh, actually, this process here is probably the better process than what I've used. Uh, you see, that was something that God was just showing me about it. He was telling me, you can have all the tips in the world, but unless you have the right tool for the job, uh, the tip is useless. Uh, so, I can tell you to read your Bible 200 times, but unless you read it, it's useless. Uh, so anyway, you just take it and pull it, and press, pull it out of there, press it out of there. But be careful, and don't cut your finger. I hope I don't cut mine. Uh, so, uh, <laughs> yeah. Uh, oh, by the way, on one of my other videos, I was showing y'all how to do uh, one of these little cans here, and I had a little thumbtack in there, and the thumbtack bent. That's only happened to me twice out of the hundreds of these that I build. Uh, I build these and just give them out to people, uh, you know, in my spare time. Instead of watching uh, a lot of television and things of that nature, uh, I build those things. Uh, so anyway, uh, there we have it. Uh, now we got to retrofit this sucker in here. Alright, perfect. Alrighty. So what I'm going to have to do now is this. See, it's just on the inner side of this line right here, so it's not quite big enough. Uh, even though this all got messed up here, but it's still not quite big enough. And what I'm going to have to do is I'm going to have to take, a, I guess, this hammer or another hammer or something and kind of ding it in a little bit to give me some more room so this thing will slide down inside there. Y'all you follow that? Uh, yeah. Okay. Well, when I figure that part out, I'll, I'll get back with you. Hello, my name is Brian Elmore, and I'm back with the King James uh, Bible Survival School. Listen, uh, as you can see, we just lit it up. And, uh, and what I've done is i put a little... Uh, part on it and I put a little battery on it. We're going to do a time test to see how long it takes to burn itself out. Uh, so now it is uh, it's 335. Um, yeah, the 335 mark. Yeah, okay, well, that's harder than you think. Uh, anyway, 335, you can see it's going, blowing good. It's turning and burning, turning and burning, baby. Uh, Okay, uh, to follow up from yesterday, uh, what we did is we did our burn test yesterday, and while I was out there burning, uh, actually the, uh, this motor here just about got burned up, uh, but I caught it just in time so it wouldn't, so it wouldn't, you know, didn't burn up, uh, but it, although it did melt good, so, uh, what I had to do was, is this, is, uh, on the front of that, you can see that little, that's a Coke can right there, the bottom of a Coke can. What I did is I turned it upside down so that, uh, um, 
so that the uh, aerodynamic of it would force the wind up. But what I, what I, how I attached that to that motor was, is uh, once all the plastic had melted off of it, the, the everything was bare on the motherboard. So what I did was, uh, I put some 100% PVC, uh, or uh, excuse me, 100% silicone on it, stuck that piece on it, and then remounted it back up in there. And, uh, and right here with these uh, little uh, pegs right here, it actually stands up quite well. Also, another thing I did is, uh, I think I drilled these out a little too big. Uh, I'm gonna do another one that, uh, this is a 7 16th, so I'm gonna do another one maybe with a with an eighth inch or something like that, just to see the, the longer, the, how long the burn time goes. This actually burns pretty good for about 45 minutes. Uh, so, uh, you know, with that being said, uh, my name is Brian Elmore, and I'm your host of the King James Bible Survival School. So thank y'all, and you'll have a good day. Okay, so this is a, uh, to let you know what the deal is, you see this is the, the fan is a computer fan. And uh, when I bought it, I had a choice to get one with an LED light or not. I didn't know how the LED light thing was going to work out, but uh, it appears it works out okay. Uh, matter of fact, I kind of like it. It gets a lot of gets a lot of head turning uh, going on and in uh, around. But if you're actually using it at a campsite, then you know how if you're dark, if it's dark where you're doing it at, you know. You know something? I'm gonna I'm gonna change the subject one second. It is five o'clock in the morning, and the Bible says if you're gonna be if you want God in the afternoon, then you have to seek Him early, right? So, so here I am, five o'clock in the morning. I'm out here minding my own business. I'm in my own yard, and it never fails. Uh, see, the Bible also says that Satan immediately cometh and taketh away the word, uh, and you can see the cars. Coming up and down the street. Man, I've been out here until I turn this thing on. It's crazy. Watch this. Here comes another moron. Look. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> yeah, I immediately come and take it away. Uh. So anyway, back to what I was at. Uh. The little LED light uh, is blue. I guess you could get one white or red or whatever. But it also lights up the ground underneath uh, if you were camping or whatnot. Uh, so, so you'd be able to see the you know the ground versus uh, underneath it. So, but I got it today. I got it set on the trash can, and uh, because I just wanted to share the share the deal with it right there. So, we're gonna let it burn a little bit. As you can see, that uh, they're not actually uh, burning on the inside of that where it's coming out of those holes yet so it's not actually gotten hot hot it's just now you know kind of started up and uh, with that little battery uh, in this little computer fan the battery is like a 500 cranking amp it's what I use in my uh, for my kayak motor so uh, well back when you see now you can see what's up that thing burning good. Turning and burning. See, you can see the whole thing is, uh, once again, there he is. Immediately. Uh, take it the way of the Lord. That's right. See, you can, now you can see the, the flame doing it. Mm -hmm. But what I really wanted to show you was this. Man, ain't that LED light just cool? <laughs> Man, I just dig it. That's the coolest thing about it. Uh, <laughs> well, no, I guess not. The coolest thing about it is the fact that, you know, God gave us some uh, heat. And a way to cook. Mm -hmm. Especially uh, since it's going to be, you know, coming again as in the days of Noah. So shall it be again in the days of coming of the Son of Man. So... Well, God bless y'all. And uh, hey, good morning to y'all, by the way. We'll see y'all when we see you. Bye-bye.